Hello, this is Lauren Lehan from SEOTools4U.com here to bring you another video on this time WordPress plugins. Now I've got an, a site here, Sony PlayStation Forum, which has got this really interesting display up here. Now I wasn't aware that I actually intentionally put it up there, but it does provide a bit of some tools to make navigating and working on this WordPress blog a lot easier. So this is, for instance, a, a trend report for the last the traffic over the last 48 hours. I can click on that, and it goes right into my admin section, and it does present this nice little graph. So this is a total unexpected find. And I can see what the, the traffic, I mean, this is a site that doesn't have really any SEO work done on it at all, but it's just percolating along, and soon I'll be doing some work on it uh, and adding some advertisement as well. But it just gives me an idea uh, just how the site's performing. So you can see some of the traffic refers. Somebody from the UK visited the site today, the top posts and pages. So it just gives me a little rundown on the how the site's performing so but the important bit is just this little bit here I can actually go in and edit my profile look at some of the comments appearance just without going you know too far away from the front page of the blog so what I'm going to do is just actually enter this in on my site SEO tools for you I'll just grab the plugin here so it's WordPress com stats and the way to add plugins, if you haven't played with WordPress, it's quite easy. So I just go into the plugin section, a new plugin, and it's just uh, coming up with a screen. I can just search on the term WordPress.com stats, and it comes up. This actually goes off to the WordPress site, displays all the plugins, and it has a rating here. In fact, the one that I was talking about, WordPress.com stats, is uh, got a ranking of three and a half, where there's some that have just almost five. This one here looks like it's got five. But I'll just stick with this one for now. I'll just click Install Now, respond to the prompt, activate the plugin. It's pretty easy. Um, you can update WordPress just by clicking up here as well so it's a it's a nice easy way of uh, working with the, the plugins now it's just going to ask for the API key which I'll type in here and this is the API that interacts with the WordPress add this block to my WordPress account click here so you actually have to go to wordpress.com create an account and then all this is managed within that save the options I can count the register users that count the pages views of registered users who are logged in so I can see as somebody who's registered to this blog what pages I can get a page count for that user so I'll just select that save and go up here click on the title to go to my blog and it's not quite there yet what I might do is just pause just for a second just back in a second okay um, as you can see here it says visit your dashboard to see your site stats so I just visit that Oh, it says take it easy dude uh, they're not quite ready the blog's been registered and they're tracking the uh, stats so it's just a matter of just waiting have a sarsaparilla so what I'll do is I'll come back to this video in a few minutes or a few days and just uh, see what what's been displayed okay thanks for watching bye bye